Hello, I'm Bill Skelly, Chief Constable of Lincolnshire Police, and it is my absolute delight to be here today at Police Headquarters with Derek, the Chair of the Lincolnshire Branch of the International Police Association, where we are dedicating this plaque in commemoration of the life and achievements of Lincolnshire Police Sergeant Arthur Troop. Seventy years ago, Arthur was the inspiration and drive behind the creation of the International Police Association, which has grown over those years to 360,000 members in over 65 countries. It's difficult perhaps for us who weren't born then to imagine what it was like in Lincolnshire in Skegness in 1950. But I imagine some of the things that we're having to cope with in the here and now, restrictions and fears, concerns around our health, the economy, and the future of the UK might lend us to believe that we can associate with some of the pressures that Arthur and people of that time were contending with. So it is all the more surprising and also grateful as far as we are concerned that he took the time and made the effort to create an association of friendship across the policing community, an inspiration which has grown over the years to be truly international. It is absolutely my delight as Chief Constable to dedicate this plaque, which we intend installing at Skegness Police Station, which is currently being refurbished in order to provide training accommodation for future recruits. I think it's really fitting that they will be in a building named Arthur Arthur with a plaque above the door as they embark upon their future police careers. Servo per Hamico, that is the motto of the International Police Association. In friendship, we join together and support each other. And right now, that feels like a really important message. It's my real pleasure now to hand over to Derek, the chair of Lincolnshire's branch of the IPA. Derek. Thank you. I would just like to thank the Chief Constable Bill Skelly for the unveiling of the plaque to Arthur Troop. We're very, very grateful and uh, this morning a letter was sent to the Chief Constable from Sean Hannigan, the Vice President of the IPA. Uh, I think Sean says everything in his letter and I intend to read the letter. Um, it's addressed to the Chief and it says, Dear Chief Constable Skelly, I would like to thank you for the fantastic support that has been given to the IPA over your tenure. Naming the location where Arthur Troop BEM served from 1948 to 1956 as the Arthur Troop building and using it for training is an incredible honour. I'm quite convinced that Arthur could never have imagined that his vision of promoting friendship with colleagues across the world would have developed into the largest friendship organisation. The 70th anniversary year we find ourselves in has been a challenging one for police officers, police staff and impacted heavily on the wider police family. The IPA has demonstrated that Servo Per Hamico has been a, really, a real part of, to the answer to this and other challenges. Thank you so very much for your leadership, drive and friendship. On behalf of the President of Section UK IPA, Clive Wood, I'd like to invite you to our gala dinner at our National Council meeting on the 5th of June 2021, which will be held in Lincolnshire. I would also like to invite you to consider a rededication of the Arthur Troop building at a time that is convenient to you, perhaps during the NCM on the 4th of June 2021. I'd like you to accept the IPA gifts as a mark of our friendship to you personally and in acknowledgement of the great work of the Lincolnshire IPA branch. Thank you once again, Chief Constable Skelly, and I look forward to meeting you in the near future and hope you continue to enjoy the opportunities the IPA offers. As I said, that was from Sean Hannigan, the Vice President. So on behalf of the IPA, Bill, I'd like to present you with uh, with the goodies and a little keepsake on behalf of the IPA. And as chair of the Lincolnshire branch 
of the IPA, I'd like to reiterate the words of Sean. Um, really many, many thanks indeed for your help, support and time given, especially to the Lincolnshire branch and also if you could convey our thanks to your team as well. Finally, <coughs> excuse me, finally on behalf of uh, everybody, I'd just like to say that uh, good wishes in your retirement. We hope you have a happy and very enjoyable retirement from the police service. Thank you. Thank you.